Okay, guys, we are back. Let's continue on. Now we're in the post game now. Tell her we're sorry for what we did, trapping her for so long. Will you? I know that sorry's not enough, but yeah, yeah, you're the boss, boss. Hmm. Rainy, what's up? You know something. I'll try to explain. But on the way, we're going to Belong Garden. It's crazy that the game traveled us all the way back here. Hey, let's go wait on the deck. We still have our levels, no less. Pretty awesome. We need to ensure the safety of our world. Yeah, that whole thing that happened with the, uh, with the, uh, with Lon, and in the original timeline, it's like, oh, what's going to happen with the Final Fantasy characters? But we don't know because everything got reversed. And the only way that could happen is Tama sacrificing herself. Tell me one thing. This time. Do you remember what you two were like and the terrible things you did? Yes, a lot of it anyway. But we're ready. We're going to collect our mirages and face all of our mistakes head on. All right then. So why did you call me back? If we have the final showdown now, our fam, you and us won't make it. It's not, not going to be, be the outcome, outcome that we're hoping for. You don't you know that. It, it hasn't even... I do, I do know. know! Look. I was there. Please. Don't, don't fight, fight the Heralds yet. yet. Help, help us save, save Grimoire, Grimoire first. Great. We could really, really use your help. For real. Do you have a plan? We're going to use the portal. The ultimate gate? What do you want with that? If you're thinking about opening it again... No, it would, it would never, never work, work without, without you, Wynn. Well, actually, we need all of the summoners for it to work. Lon is right. Summoners have the power to bring mirages from other worlds into this one. Basically, they create a bridge between two worlds. But so can you. In fact, the power is stronger in Mirage Keepers. Don't look at me. I'm just regurgitating all the stuff that Rain told me she remembers now. <laughs> the Mirage Keepers' powers, they're not like those of the summoners. It's true. We trap mirages, using miniature worlds that are created by real architects, like our father. And once they're confined, we can release them. And at that point, they're ours to command at will. But to pull that off, you need to bend the rules. And only breakers like our mother can do that. Is that true? So then, your parents' talents, they became yours, to wield any mirage. Yes. Yes. And there's more to it. Breakers can extract power from any of their mirages, and then add it to their own. So the more we find, the stronger me and Rain can make ourselves. We didn't give it much thought when we were collecting them back then, but... In fact, we stole our mom's power along with her mirages. Wait. If you can't, if Keepers can't actually connect two worlds... Yeah, when I summon Brandalus, I... Uh, I sort of had to borrow your powers when I used the crystal cage. That explains it. I could feel it too. It's like the cage. It was drawing the strength right out of me. And while I was trapped in there, the Heralds could draw on my power. And even poses me. Hmm. Wait a minute. Then, did they? Yes. They slowly deceived the world with the Crimson Prophecy, so that Lon would restore the gate. And by gathering up the other summoners, again, they managed to create a bridge. Right. That explains a lot of things. Okay. So going back. The ultimate gate. Why do you need it? It's too late to destroy it. We know. Even if we do, 
orc take out Brandulus, then we're still stuck with a world full of Cogno we can't get rid of. I mean, we can call a king of Bahamut at this point. We don't have to call him Brandulus. Right. We hope if we reverse the flow. That's just me. It'll send the Cogna and Heralds back where they came from. So please, if you and the summoners help us, we can do this, Alwyn. I. Uh, I know that after all we've done, we don't have any right to ask this. I'll do it. Huh? Honestly, I'm not so sure about your plan. It might work like you say, and then again, it might not. But I feel like it's something worth trying. Still. Yes. They'll come after us if they catch on. It's more than that. The Heralds are using your pain. You know that. But you can trust me. Trust us to take care of it. Okay. When you feel you're ready, say the word. <laughs> Thank you so much, Win. I'm... I'm sorry. Oh, forget it. You can call me Win. <laughs> It feels too strange, Alan, <laughs> coming from you two. Uh, <laughs> hey, maybe there's a chance. This arm's gonna bring the world some joy. I know it. I <laughs> can go both ways. Uh, new worlds are available at Chocobalina's Market. Alright, cool. If you're looking for some more mirages, don't forget which pixies rock in the old rumor radar. Uh, you hear that sound? Uh, Final Fantasy VIII theme. Make sure that you take a break now and then too, okay? So. Alright, let's go get out of here. We have no more Tama at all. I mean, we probably can get her from the, um, we probably can get her from the, um, prison case, obviously. Um, I wonder if she get, I wonder if she got upgraded. Um, let's see, let's switch to Chocobo with her, if she's even around. And she is not. There's other, there's other monsters I should level up to, which I have not level up. Um, I got two of these. Oh yeah, Walter and, and Thane. But look, we got Selfie. Selfie is a replacement for Tama. Alright. And what does Tama have? Tama has nothing. Nothing. Nothing to upgrade for. Let's see. It's uh, 82. 82 on, to on her. On Selfie. Holy shit. Might as well upgrade her right now. Get that over with. Blank space? Let's see. What should I give her as a blank space? Did your lady seed? Yeah. Why not? Magic. Magic. Balance. Accuracy. Confusion. Agility. Oh yeah, we're gonna have more than enough. We're good. Let's see. Still nothing. Alright. Let's see. Just wanna know if anyone else is gonna need to upgrade. No, no. But let's go back here. And take out some monster that we don't need. Let's see what level you're on. Level 40. Hmm. Uh -uh. Okay. Level 40. Um. Change that to that. The mimic. Change the mimic to. Let's see. Okay, yeah, why not? Um, I think that's it. At least the ones that I care about, at least. So, yeah. Alright. Uh, let's continue on. Oops. I keep doing that to myself. 
It's not you viewers, it's me. Okay, maybe it's you. Not playing. <laughs> uh, Alright. Let's keep on going here. Hey, Lon, do you remember the plea? The plea? What's a plea? I'm still a little hazy on the details myself, but... Remember how it seemed like Ifrit and Shiva and Ramu seemed to recognize us? I remember them mentioning something like that. I think there were more mirages like that. Seven of them. Oh, I get it. Is that what plead means then? <laughs> plead. But yes. <laughs> so I think pleaded. that might mean there are four other powerful mirages we knew besides Ifrit, Shiva, and Ramu. Awesome. <laughs> no kidding. Well, considering how tough that trio is, it probably wouldn't be a bad idea to get the rest of them on our side. Mm -hmm. Yep, my thoughts exactly. Alright. So, let's see. Bum, bum, buddy. No Tama. Tama's not in this universe. It's just her hey, selfie. Can I ask you something strange? Huh? Like what? Am I correct that you're in charge of controlling the gates and managing our prismariums now? Yes. What do you mean now? Right. Please. You know full well that this pixie has always been in charge of both. Hmm. <laughs> I can't carry the bruise in case everywhere we go, but we can access it from safe locations. And you're the one who returns us to Ninewood Hills when we fall in battle? Huh? Well, yeah, sort of. I have to use the return crystal Anna Crow gave me, which unfortunately means we have to come back to Ninewood Hills every time. <laughs> Hold on a second. This is strange. What's with the sudden barrage of questions? <laughs> oh, I guess I just like to go over things now and then. Huh? You serious? <laughs> I guess that means most of what I know about Tama applies to Seraphie in this timeline. As long right. as I remember that, I should be able to play along. But what happened to the Rhea from your timeline? I mean, from this timeline? Is she gone? That you just replaced her and put her into the old, to the regular timeline? Like, there's questions here. There are, there really are questions here. Like, what the fuck? Who knows? If there's a sequel, Square Enix will probably make a depressing version of, of how this turned out. Uh, who knows? You know how Square Enix can be. Hello. Hello. Whose soul will you touch? Let's see. I want to touch a lot of souls. No, no, no. Uh, let's get rid of that one since we already did it before. And now we got these. Hmm. Let's start with the first one for now. <clears throat> Sorry about that. <clears throat> so it's been that long. None of us know exactly how long it's been. Oh, keys this. But it's estimated the giants who lived here must have disappeared about a hundred years ago. A century. Huh. It's a little hard to imagine. <laughs> well, why don't we head back to the airship and... Oh, Bahamut. <laughs> Was there something I could help you with, Bahamut? Right. Oh. Or should I call you Tia Babalo? <laughs> You dare speak my true name before a stranger and you <laughs> What is going on? It's been a century, you said? Been quite a while. But I used to know old Bahamut here. You know the Dyad Servant? A servant? Me. <laughs> a servant? Me? <laughs> Sorry. She means that you once served Lon and Rain. Oh, yes. Yeah. What? Lon and Rain are the demon Dyad? The Herald, probably Seguaritas, must have concocted the name to spice up their crimson prophecy. For real. But, there's a basis to it. The original Azure prophecy mentions demons too. <sighs> Did Lon and Rain know? Could they have read it? Rain always wins. Hmm. <laughs> 
Yes, she was. Except acting out prophecies seems like fun. You know, you're kind of taking all the wonder out of my childhood here. Hmm. One thing I know, no one would have started calling them the Demon Dyad or whatever if you hadn't been there, acting like demons and wreaking havoc against their will. You can blame the heroes for that. I don't care how long I was sealed away. How dare the fabulous name is Army Muhammad? Can't declare himself king of this world? I'll kill him! <laughs> Is that the reason you're here? Listen, I've observed Brandalus up close for a century, and... Tia Babolo. Face it, you don't stand the slightest chance against him. What was that? <laughs> the X-9 Knights. I trust you've heard of them. They're a fusion of three things. An Esper like me. A human. And lastly, a god from the Extraverse. Gods from the Extraverse? Espers? What are those? Well, the Asher prophecy makes mention of them both. Essentially, it says, From oblivion, light and dark were born. Light begat beings called Espers. Dark begat monsters. And humans who saw the light. In the Extraverse, the world that surrounds ours, live gods that feed solely on death and destruction. Gods... That are beings and non beings, and will not heed reason. One world found a tear in the fabric and exploited it to confine espers inside their human bodies. Hmm. However, this tear left them open to the extroverse and its cruel gods. Sounds vulgar. So no. then, does that mean the heralds are those exact same gods? I can't say anything with real certainty yet. In the end, the prophecy is just words. So the best we can do is venture a guess at what it means. In fact, it's because this first section was so ambiguous, it was omitted from copies. Only direct descendants know it. That, hmm. that would make you... A direct yes. descendant. That's right. The first summoner's descendant. Oh, and probably the last giant summoner, I would imagine. Although... It seems that some of you have picked up the art of summoning in our place. You'll keep it alive. Enough! <laughs> Get to the point! Are you saying that Brandalus has become an X-9 knight? Yes, that's right. A being who, just like in the prophecy, has crossed dimensions. Mm. In a way, what else can you call him but a god? He's completely different from the Brandalus that you think you know. You can't beat him. You can't even touch him. <laughs> this cannot be! What you say is impossible! It doesn't matter what Brandalus is like now! He's not me! I'm the true king! The Bahamut King! Tia! Tia Babalu the Great! <laughs> Great. I see your temper's as short as ever. <laughs> Why are we fighting? <laughs> Why are we fighting for boss time against Bahamut himself? What the? Uh, Hi guys. So the demon diehard thing, what is talking about us, huh? Yeah, I kind of figured as much by now to be honest. Oh. <laughs> have to remember my past if it's this much of a train wreck? Well, <laughs> hang on. From what Wynn was saying, weren't most of our crimes against humanity caused by these troublemakers? Why? Don't you ask me! What are you two doing here? Would you quit it? You really need a lesson in anger management. For real. What? Oh, also, we should forget about messing with the heralds. It's true, you can't win. In order to prove just how wrong you are. Okay! Alright then. Let's uh fast forward through this. Yeah, do really good damage on him. So and he has a lot of HP too, so yeah, we're barely doing a little damage to him at all. Um Let's 
Let's see. Sure. Let's see. Is there, is there like a freaking counter? Yeah, supposedly there's a freaking timer. Timer to what? What is this? Is this supposed to be me beating him faster before the time was over? Because that would suck. If it is that, then that really sucks. Oh, he doesn't. Oh, he does a move that kills both of us. Which one is it? Seriously. Oh. Yep, it's the ladder. This is gonna hurt, is it? Ooh. Um. Oh, he's resistant to ice. Who knew? Maybe not water. Don't even have water. Yeah. Oh, he's resistant to that too. Huh. Ooh. Let's uh, fix our balance here. You know, ass kicked here. Um, let's see. No. Hmm. I'm trying to find something that will put our hubs all the way up here. Hmm. The holy torch. Use those X potions. Damn, I should sure put balance. We're about to fall. Yeah. Um. At least with her, use a high potion. Come on. Yeah, just attack. Stock. Uh, let's see. Thunder? Oh, okay. I think he's resistant to all elements. It makes sense. Still got a long way to go to fight this guy. Oh, brother. Help me. Oh, he's resistant to uh, late, at least. I mean, not resistant. He's a weak to late. That's a good thing. Let's continue on fighting him. Oh. Someone help us. That could have been a lot worse. Really a lot worse. But it wasn't, so we're good. Um, yeah, that will cure him. Even, even if it's just a little bit of cure, still cure him. To use the X potion. Oh, great. Um, ooh. Um, oh, damn. 
Damn. Phoenix down here. Sadly. Um X potion. They're doing pretty good. Like we could, we could, we could be doing a lot, a lot worse here. Yeah, let's just keep on attacking and heal him. Just a little bit of his health. Okay. Do I have left six? Uh, no, nope, I can't do anything. Alright. Oh, that's good damage. Really good damage. Give her X potion. Come on, where's it? Okay. And get a thousand hits there. All right. Again, we're doing really, really good. Surprisingly, um, if you want to attack there. Stock. Uh. Let's see. Yeah, heal him all the way. I was gonna um, do another video, but we almost got this guy. Um, it should not be. Okay. Hurry up, game. Okay. It could have been so much worse. him an X potion. And right attack again. Good for a regular attack. Do this again. And heal herself. Potions again. Got three left of these. Holy shit. Um.
We're getting there, guys. We are getting there. Um, it's a. Uh... Okay. Ooh, we're doing really, really good. Him. I think we got him, guys. Oh. I'm nervous here. <laughs> oh, shit. Let's see. It's hard time now. Okay, kill her all the way. And for him. We got him? Yes, we got him! We did it, guys! We did it! We defeated Bahamut! Whew.